Springtime marks the start of race season in Siouxland, and the spread of COVID-19 apparently won't change that. Two local tracks say the green flag will fly this weekend. KCAU 9 reporter Jessica Watson caught up with one of those track owners today to find out what's planned and how officials are responding. That's in our top story tonight at 6. Both Park Jefferson and the new Raceway Park have plans to hold races this weekend despite the CDC's recommendation to limit large groups of people. I kind of followed suit with what the track did across the street. Steve Corrali is the owner of the new Raceway Park and says they will be taking extreme caution, checking temperatures at the door and requiring face masks. Even though his grandstand can hold 1,500 people, he will only be selling 500 tickets. We're trying to maybe set a trend for the whole United States as a safer way to try to get back into the racing game here. And, and who knows, maybe some of the other sports, outdoor sports during the summer. Since both tracks are located outside of city limits, they don't have to follow city ordinances. County officials say there isn't anything they can do legally to stop the races either. At this point in time, I don't believe anybody believes that the county or the ordinances that pertain to counties uh, give us, us meaning the counties, uh, an option to make a, uh, an ordinance that would create a, a criminal liability for a violation of, of those types of standards, whatever those standards would be if they were placed in an ordinance. The Sheriff of Union County also said they don't have the authority to enforce CDC recommendations at events like these. The county does have an ordinance in place, but it only offers recommendations for people in Union County. There are no laws that we're breaking by opening this track at this time. In a press conference on Monday, Governor Kim Reynolds seemed to be unaware of the track's plans to open up this weekend, but said she'll look into it. Not heard of that situation. Why don't you let me um, communicate with some of those folks and see what their plans are. I had not heard about that. Jessica Watson, KCAU 9 News.